How's it going guys? Welcome back to the learning styles lesson of what makes a good pre-health college course. Um, today we're going to be diving into some of the learning styles as well as Madeline and I are both going to um, tell you what kind of learners we are. Um, so if you want to start. Yes, for sure. So first we'll start with the visual learning style. So being a visual learner um, or having a strength in visual learning just means that you're very good at reading things or diagrams, reading text, anything like that, and learning well and retaining that information from visual cues. And then there's also auditory learning, so that's the second type of learning style. And auditory um, is pretty self-explanatory. Um, you listen to something, and those auditory learners are usually very strong at um, retaining information from auditory signals. So an example that combines the two would be like a YouTube video. So um, a YouTube video, you're obviously listening to the ta the audio, so like what you're kind of doing right now, and then. Um, the visual part of that would be looking at a diagram maybe that's on the screen and retaining that information from the diagram because that's a visual cue. And now Brandon will talk a little bit about kinesthetic learning. So kinesthetic learning is the last learning style we're going to dive into. Uh, it has to do with doing, um, building things with your hands, physically making models um, so that you can understand them better. Uh, one example would be uh, learning cell structure using a model kit, physically building the cell to figure out what it looks like um, is kinesthetic learning. We would love for you guys to take the quiz that we linked in here. Um, it just gives you a little bit uh, of an insight into what type of learner you could be. Remember, um, there's no great, or there is a lot of gray area. There's no one or the other. You guys can be um, visual kinesthetic. You can be um, visual auditory. There's there's a multitude of combinations, so don't feel like you have to fit into a box. But this is to help you find your strengths and. Uh, and figure out what type of learner you are. Yeah, for example, I am mostly a visual learner, I would say, um, and it's because I have a little bit of a photographic memory, um, but not everyone has that. Um, but I also learn really well kinesthetically, and I think part of that is also due to sports and, you know, just using, being so used to doing things physically and learning in that way. So um, I think I'm a little bit of a mix of both, so I don't know about you. Yeah, I would say I fit right in the same category, uh, visual kinesthetic. I definitely... Um, seeing things written on the board, uh, reading things multiple times over um, helps me learn a lot as well as like you said I think playing sports for me had a huge part in it and just my whole life having to hear things, learn them and then act them out with my body. Being able to move around and physically do things helped me, helped me learn them. Mm. So. And again, like Brandon said, just to reiterate, uh, taking this linked quiz will help you identify, you know, what learning style might be one of your strengths, but by no means is it su supposed to, you know, like Brandon said, put you in a box. Um, you can be all three learning styles, but you might be a little bit better at one than the other. So um, we hope you learned a lot from, you know, exactly what each learning style is, and uh, we really hope that this quiz and the rest of this course um, and lesson will help you to identify exactly, you know, what your strengths are and when it comes to learning styles. Thank you. Yeah, we'll see you guys later.